and welcome to my channel. This is Sandy here, and today I am super excited to be participating in another collab, and this one is the Under the Cabinet Organization um, Challenge that is hosted by Therapeutic Design by Deborah. I'm very excited about this one because I know that I have more than my pick of cabinets that need some work. So when I saw this challenge, I'm like, let me jump on this. This will give me an excuse to do something that I should have done a long time ago. So let me get started and show you what I'm doing. All right, so this is the cabinet that I am going to be working on. This is a kitchen cabinet where I keep plastic wares, I keep my um, Instant Pot in here and just some miscellaneous things. Um, and it has not been cleaned out in a while. Actually, since I moved in my house um, almost two years ago, I put things in there. Believe it or not, they were organized. And over time, they have just become pretty much a mess. So a special thanks to Deborah at Therapeutic Designs by Deborah for hosting this challenge because as you can see, I've got work to do. So let me get started. So I've pulled everything out of there and now I've got to clean it out. I've had all of these plastic pieces in here, pitchers, water bottles, graters, you name it, <laughs> all of that in there. And then over here, I have my appliances that I had. So my Instant Pot and juicer that I rarely use and my Vitamix. Okay, so this is the after. I think it looks a lot better. At least everything is stacked and I know where I've placed everything. And I place things in here based on what I reach for uh, most often. So I've got my cutting boards there on the side, my Instant Pot I reach for almost daily. And then my Vitamix is there, my strainers, colanders, whatever. I've got my instruction books to my um, Vitamix, my coffee maker and that there, um, just as a placeholder. And I've got my bigger bowls there stacked in the back. I'm happy with the way that it turned out. Um, I think it is a lot better, but the best part about this exercise is that I did some purging. So not everything that I had in there needed to stay in there, and that's the best part. I had all of these plastic containers in here that either did not have lids or just extra lids. I don't know where the bowls are to them. So all of this extra plastic wear, I'm going to pack this up and like if it's got two pieces, I'll take that and uh, donate it. But these miscellaneous lids, I will just toss them because I don't have the bowls for them. So. All of that was down in this cabinet, cluttering it up. And that was the reason why I couldn't keep it organized because I had too much junk in there. So I'm really happy that I did this. I thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was inspirational for you. If you have a cabinet in your home under the counter that is in need of work, uh, again, thanks to Deborah for hosting this challenge. There will be a playlist so that you can check out all of the participants in this challenge. And I will see you back here next time. Bye-bye.